Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be running you through my top three pairs of jeans. These are my cannot live without tried and tested jeans. So for anyone who's new to my channel, um, size wise, I'm like a size 16 on top and an 18 on bottom. One thing I always struggle with is finding really nice good quality jeans that actually fit me properly. My bum and my hips are quite wide and quite often when it comes to buying jeans, I find that I either have to, have to like sacrifice getting it to fit my hips or getting it to fit my waist. And it's really difficult to find a pair of jeans that does all of that. I've done quite a few um, jeans review videos on here before, I'll link some down below um, in case you guys are interested. But there are three pairs of jeans. I mean, I have more than three pairs of jeans, but these are the ones that honestly I think are the best finds. These are my most worn, could not live without jeans. So out of the jeans I'm gonna show you, they're all different kind of styles, different washes of denim and different prices as well. So there should be something to suit everyone in this video. I'm gonna be chucking up some footage of me wearing the jeans as well so you guys can get a better idea of how they actually look and fit. First pair of jeans I have are these ones. So I actually got these quite recently. These are the high waist mum jeans from Florence and Fred at Tesco. And I cannot believe I found a pair of jeans like this at Tesco. They are so comfortable. So I got these in the black. They also do them in a kind of mid blue wash as well. Um, and these are incredible. These are so curve friendly. Like I said, I'm about a UK 18 on bottom and a 16 on top. I got these ones in a size 18 and the, the fit of them is perfect honestly absolutely perfect they come in at the top exactly how i want to pretty much every single pair of mum jeans i have tried on previous to getting these i tend to get that big bit of gaping at the back i just have excess material where it doesn't fit my waist properly i don't get that with these they honestly fit so so well i'm so impressed these i'm pretty sure i can't remember i think they were only about 20 pounds which is insane and I actually love this it's a very very subtle washed out black denim I don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera properly but yeah it's not like a jet black it's very slightly vintagey look these go with so many things I love kind of like tucking stuff in the top um they go great with like heeled boots trainers whatever it is mum jeans I feel like they're definitely a staple they're so comfortable but I feel like when you're curvier, sometimes it's difficult to get a pair of mum jeans that are actually flattering. These are still gonna give you that nice kind of hourglass shape um, whilst being comfortable. They're really affordable. I cannot say any more nice stuff about these jeans. I'm obsessed with them. I do have an alternative to these um, in case you don't have um, a Tesco that has a big clothing section or you can't get in. I found a very, very similar pair from Marks and Spencers. I will link the Marks and Spencers one down below because Tesco don't have an online section. Um, the Marks and Spencers one, they are more expensive. I think they're about 40 pounds. However, the fabric is insane. If I didn't already get the Florence and Fred ones, I would get the Marks and Spencers one because I feel like they would be longer lasting. The Marks and Spencers ones also have a little bit of give to them as well. So if you're looking for a super comfortable pair, these are comfy, but the Marks and Spencers ones were really, really good. So it depends what your budget is. Obviously the Florence and Fred ones are half the price, but the Marks and Spencers ones I think would last you a fair bit longer. Um, but yeah, if I didn't have the Florence and Fred ones, I would get the Marks and Spencers ones, but both are extremely good. On top of that, you also get this free belt when you get the um, Tesco ones and it's actually really nice. So it has a really kind of subtle um, kind of snake print effect to it. And it has this big silver buckle, which has that kind of, I don't know what they call it, like a knocked effect. I'm honestly so impressed. If you guys have been following me for a while, you will know how many pairs of mum jeans I have tried on. Literally every every time I do a haul, I always try the mum jeans and I've never found anything that's been perfect until I found these. So massive thumbs up from me. Okay, the next 
pair of jeans I have are these ones. These are actually from Topshop. They are the Jamie jeans. I actually have a couple of pair of these and these jeans are insane. They're really nice and high-waisted. They're a nice kind of, they're a thick denim, but they're super stretchy. Like, look at that. These are so comfortable. If you want the perfect pair of skinny jeans, you need to go and check these out. Um, they're, like I said, a nice kind of thicker style denim. So they feel really sturdy. They feel like they're gonna last a long time. I know they last a long time because I have loads of these already. And they also do these in so many different washes as well. So I have them in this kind of medium wash. I just think they're really versatile. They go with so many different things. Um, and I got these in a 34 waist, 32 leg. So like I said, I'm about a size 18 um, and I'm five foot seven. And I, I love the way that they fit. They're kind of like more ankle grazery on me. These are honestly, I can't stress enough how comfortable these are. I have put on weight in lockdown. So these are feeling a little bit tighter than they normally do, but they still fit absolutely amazingly. I have some very similar, um, which have rips in them as well. And that's what I like about the Jamie jeans is, it is frustrating when you find a pair of jeans and you wanna buy that pair of jeans in like loads of different colors. And sometimes stores don't stock that. Topshop do that. So with the Jamie jeans, you'll be able to find them in loads of different styles, like rips, no rips, loads of different washes. Um, Topshop's really versatile with that. Topshop has actually just been bought by ASOS. So you now have to shop. Every, I think everything's on there. I found the link for these earlier. Um, so yeah, you can order them through ASOS now. I have also tried the Johnny jeans um, and the Johnny jeans are also good. So I believe the Jamie jeans are about 35 to 40 pounds, depending on what kind of wash and style you get. The Johnny jeans are a lot cheaper. They're more like 20, 25 pounds. However, the Johnny jeans are considerably thinner than the Jamie jeans. So if you want ones that are gonna last you a long time, it is worth splashing out and getting the Jamie jeans um, because they are a lot longer lasting. I have had the Johnny jeans as well. They fit very similar, similarly, similarly, similarly. That's a struggle. Um, they're very similar in the way that they fit, um, but they, the fabric is a lot thinner, like a lot, a lot. And I have worn through pairs of those um, previously. So Jamie, in my opinion, is the way forward. And then last but not least, these bad boys here. So these are a super high-waisted pair of skinny jeans, and these are from Marks and Spencers. In case you haven't realized, Love me some Marks and Spencer's jeans. These are actually from Per Una Denim. I will link these down below. I'll link everything that I can down below um, for you guys to go check out. I actually sized down in these. I got these in a size 16 regular um, because similar to the Jamie jeans, they are very, very stretchy. I personally like my jeans quite figure hugging um so if you're between sizes definitely go down um or if you like them tight go down and you know the fabric is so forgiving that you can get away with that i absolutely love this wash these again come in loads of different washes i went for the washed out black and i absolutely love them they have that really nice kind of vintage denim vibe so I think on their website, they have them in a, this is the washed black. They have them in a really dark blue, a mid blue, and also a kind of gray color as well. So not as many choices as the Jamie jeans, but still like you get your basics in there. Um, and these are 35 pounds. These are, comparing these to the Jamie jeans, they are a thinner um, kind of denim. They still have a similar amount of stretch, if you like thick denim go with the jamie if you like the thinner ones go for these but i do actually think that these are better quality than the top shop johnny jeans um they're similar in the fact that they're thinner denim like the johnny jeans from top shop but these are definitely better lasting i've worn these to death already i've not even had them that long and i've worn them so much and i am obsessed with them in general, I think Marks and Spencers is really good for curve-friendly kind of jeans. I've tried a few different bits on from there, but I'd say these and their kind of high-waisted mum jeans are very good. 
obviously I am always on the lookout for more jeans I love reviewing jeans and kind of finding new styles and stuff um but those are honestly I have been just on the hunt for jeans for, for years now that I absolutely love and it's taken me so long um to actually find styles and places that I know do the kind of jeans that I like I've wasted so much money in the past getting jeans I just don't wear enough because they're not perfect and I'm so so fussy with my jeans and how they fit if they're not perfect I don't keep them so overall kind of store wise like I said the top shop Jamie jeans are the best ones and Marks and Spencer's new look is also very good I will say that I've previously had jeans from new look I'd say the sizing is a little bit hit and miss sometimes but you can pick up some really nice kind of fashionable jeans for really really good prices um so if you're looking for more kind of rip style things like that new look is really really good for that um but yeah those are just i wanted to kind of report back because i obviously know that i do a lot of haul videos and things like that um where i just try stuff on but i never kind of report back and tell you these are the things that i am in love with and cannot live without and i honestly think that those three jeans would totally have you covered if you're looking to kind of create a capsule wardrobe you don't really need any more than what i just showed you there so I hope this video has been useful for any curvy girls who are looking for some really great curve friendly jeans out there. Um, they have my seal of approval anyway. Um, like I said, I will link them all down below in case you guys do want to go and check them out. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel. And if you haven't already subscribed, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss an upcoming video. And until next time, I will see you guys later.